An important skill for us to work on now is being able to add measurements that are made in feet and inches. So the most important thing for us to remember when we're trying to, to combine feet and inches together is that there are 12 inches in every one foot. Now let's take an example of adding a couple of these measurements together. So let's add 3 feet 3 inches and 2 feet 5 inches. So I'll write this out here. 3 feet 3 inches plus 2 feet 5 inches. And all we're going to try to do at the start is add together the feet first and then add together the inches after. So 3 feet plus 2 feet is going to give us 5 feet and then 3 inches plus 5 inches is going to give us 8 inches. So 3 foot 3 plus 2 foot 5 equals 5 foot 8. Now this is a good at common type of measurement so we should be happy with that. 5 foot 8 looks right. Let's try the same technique with example 2 here. So Christine has to add two sections of baseboards together. She has one that's 4 foot 7 and the other that's 6 foot 6 and she has to determine the total length that she has to work with if she has to put these baseboards around a room or around a corner. She needs to know the total amount that she has available to her. So we're going to go through the same thing here. We're going to try to add 4 feet 7 inches plus 6 feet 6 inches. And we're going to run through the same technique. First we'll add the feet. So 4 feet plus 6 feet is 10 feet. And now we're going to add the inches. 7 inches plus 6 inches is 13 inches. Okay. Now we stop and look at this addition that we just did. 10 feet, 13 inches. Something's not right there. And that's because 13 inches is bigger than a foot. So we have to make a little adjustment here. Instead of writing 10 foot 13, we're going to take 12 of those inches from 13 and we're going to turn that into a foot and we're going to have one inch left over. So this is really the same as 11 feet 1 inch or 11 foot 1.